Physiology of Leptin Introduction Leptin is a product of the obese gene, which is expressed primarily in adipocytes. Leptin acts on leptin receptors, which are widely distributed, and account for its pleiotropic effects on energy homeostasis and neuroendocrine, reproductive and immune function. The main function of leptin is to signal the brain that the body has enough energy stored in the form of fat, thus reducing hunger and promoting a feeling of fullness. When the level of body fat increases, more leptin is produced and released into the bloodstream, which signals the hypothalamus in the brain to reduce hunger and increase energy expenditure. Conversely, when the level of body fat decreases, less leptin is produced, which signals the brain to increase hunger and reduce energy expenditure. This helps to maintain energy balance and prevent excessive weight loss or weight gain. In addition to its role in regulating energy balance, leptin has been shown to have a number of other physiological effects, including regulation of the immune system, regulation of bone growth and metabolism, and modulation of reproductive function. Let's discuss these in detail about these actions. Effect of leptin on bone metabolism. Leptin has been shown to have a significant effect on bone metabolism. This hormone plays a crucial role in regulating bone growth and remodeling, and has been shown to influence the differentiation and activation of bone-forming cells, osteoblast, and bone-resorbing cells, osteoclast. Studies have shown that high levels of leptin are associated with increased bone formation and reduced bone resorption, leading to an overall increase in bone density. On the other hand, low levels of leptin have been linked to decreased bone formation and increased bone resorption, leading to a decrease in bone density and an increased risk of osteoporosis. Leptin has been shown to stimulate the production of bone-forming cells and inhibits the production of bone-resorbing cells, leading to an overall increase in bone density. It also promotes the differentiation of bone-forming cells into mature, functional cells that are able to produce bone matrix. In addition, leptin has been shown to regulate bone mass by affecting bone mineral metabolism and bone turnover, as well as by modulating the activity of hormones that regulate bone metabolism, such as insulin-like growth factor 1 and parathyroid hormone. Effect of leptin on the reproductive system Leptin has a significant impact on the reproductive system and plays a key role in regulating the function of the hypothalamic, pituitary, gonadal axis, which is responsible for the regulation of gonadal function and the secretion of reproductive hormones. In addition, leptin has been shown to regulate the secretion of gonadotropin-releasing hormone, which is essential for the regulation of the hypothalamic, pituitary, gonadal axis and the secretion of luteinizing hormone and follicle-stimulating hormone. In females, leptin has been shown to regulate the menstrual cycle by affecting the secretion of follicle-stimulating hormone and luteinizing hormone, which is essential for the development and ovulation of the follicle. High levels of leptin have been linked to increased luteinizing hormone secretion, which can lead to the stimulation of ovulation. Leptin also has a direct effect on the ovaries and has been shown to regulate the production of estrogens, which play a key role in regulating the menstrual cycle and reproductive function. In males, leptin has been shown to regulate testosterone secretion by affecting the function of the Leydig cells in the testes, which are responsible for the production of testosterone. High levels of leptin have been linked to increased testosterone secretion, which can have a positive effect on sperm production and male fertility. Effect of leptin on the immune system. Leptin has been shown to play a role in the regulation of the immune system and has been described as a link between energy metabolism and the immune response. This hormone has been shown to have both pro-inflammatory and anti-inflammatory effects on the immune system, depending on the type and stage of the immune response. In general, high levels of leptin have been shown to have a pro-inflammatory effect on the immune system and to enhance the production of cytokines, which are proteins that play a key role in the regulation of the immune response. This can lead to an increase in the production of pro-inflammatory cytokines, such as interleukin-1 and tumor necrosis factor alpha, which play a key role in the initiation and progression of the immune response. On the other hand, low levels of leptin have been linked to a decreased immune response and to a reduction in the production of cytokines, 
which can result in an impaired ability to fight infections and a higher risk of developing autoimmune disorders. In addition, leptin has been shown to play a role in the regulation of T-cell differentiation and activation, and has been shown to play a role in the regulation of the immune response to infections and in the development of autoimmune disorders. Clinical Significance Leptin has been implicated in several diseases and disorders, including obesity, type 2 diabetes, cardiovascular disease, and infertility. In obesity, high levels of leptin are often present, but the hormone is not able to signal the brain effectively, leading to a state of leptin resistance. This means that the body is not able to respond to the signals from leptin, which results in the failure of the body to regulate energy balance and food intake. As a result, individuals with leptin resistance are unable to lose weight and are at a higher risk of developing obesity-related diseases, such as type 2 diabetes and cardiovascular disease. In type 2 diabetes, leptin has been shown to play a role in the regulation of glucose metabolism and insulin sensitivity. High levels of leptin have been linked to insulin resistance, which is a key factor in the development of type 2 diabetes. In cardiovascular disease, leptin has been shown to play a role in the regulation of blood pressure and lipid metabolism. High levels of leptin have been linked to an increased risk of cardiovascular disease, as well as to the development of obesity, type 2 diabetes, and other metabolic disorders. In infertility, leptin has been shown to play a role in the regulation of the hypothalamic pituitary gonadal axis and the secretion of reproductive hormones. High levels of leptin have been linked to infertility in both males and females and to the development of menstrual disorders and polycystic ovary syndrome in females. That's all for the video. We'll see you next time.